been really down on Brock Purdy all offseason. I'm like, look, he's not the same guy. Totally different dude. All these picks in practice. This could translate. To his credit, he looked the same freaking guys last year. He didn't throw picks. He looked good. It was his first game. It was his first live action back from tearing his UCL. He didn't look rusty. He looked like Brock Purdy. He's really good at rolling left and throwing. Like, no, not even being snarky. Not everyone's good at that. He's really good at that. He's really good at throwing screen passes. Ask Trey. Not so easy. Trey got picked because Trey doesn't change arm slots as naturally as Brock. Brock's great at that. So slants, dump off screens, Brock's money. Moving when throwing, Brock's money. What was, impre- what was surprising, though, was when he got in the red zone, took the sack, scrambled, couldn't score. He's been so money in the red zone for a long time, but this is one time. He's not going to be perfect in the red zone. So all credit to Brock. Maybe I'm overreacting to his training camp. I don't know. But I also feel like the Niners set him up for success. All of his throws were short and easy and wide open. And the Broncos weren't game planning. And the Broncos suck. And it's not going to be as easy week one against Pittsburgh. So still a little concerned about Brock. But not in the sense like he's not like Sam Darnold. He's a promising young quarterback. Just like Trey. Um, Is he more promising than Trey? I don't know about that. I have questions about his overall potential, but is he better than Trey right now? You'd have to say yes, because even though he's limited, he has so much playing experience, and he's so comfortable on the field where Trey needs a few drives. Trey needs some time. Trey needs to get in a rhythm. It feels like Brock's been in a rhythm since he came to the team. So all credit to Brock, all credit to the Niners for making things easy on him and protecting him and putting him in position to succeed. Uh, I like that they did that with Darnold and Trey and not just the two of them, Brock and, and Darnold. So, good job to Brock. Maybe I'm being too scared about what's going to happen, but I do feel like he got everything the Niners wanted for him. Everything was easy in this game, and he still took a sack on, one, on, on the one drive he played. So, how much contact is he going to take this year? How many hits are, is he, are, is, how many hits are is he going to take? Yeah, is, is the word. And um, can he play a full, a full season? Can any quarterback on this team play a full season? Or is this quarterback by committee? Is this like, hey, man, you get September and October, you get November, December, and you get January. Is that what's going to happen? As long as it's not Darnold in January, I think the Niners will be okay. But, I mean, I was, I was being really snarky about Brock early in the game. Like, hey, man, it was his... It was all him on those screen passes to Debo. Whatever. Is he a great quarterback? I don't think so. But they can win a lot of games with him. Let's see how far he goes and how long he stays healthy. But stock up for Brock. Stock up for Trey. No one ever wants to see Sam Darnold play again. Uh, Greg Papa said slinging Sammy Darnold. (laughs) No. No, he didn't. Drew Drew says Lance to Ayuk will be unstoppable. Deep ball him. Is it too much to ask to see Trey Lance with the starters for like one time? Is it too much to ask before you bury him on the depth chart? Calais says Trey better be QB1 during Cincy and Niners in October when I get there to watch the game. Visiting SF from Hawaii. Good luck. Don't hold your breath. Brock played well, but with this team, I prefer Trey. It's hard to say you prefer Trey when he's so far. He's just so unprepared, and it's their fault. It's crazy. I feel like a lot of people push back on that but it is their fault look what happens when you give him live live reps he should have so many more live reps at this point of his career and he doesn't why because the pandemic and the 49ers <laughs> crazy man justin cole brock did look pretty sharp nice those the Ayuk and jennings but that drive was all debo yeah no all of that's true all of that is true wave nine purdy's great drive was matched by russell wilson's athletic ability they both got three points on their drives Trey threw into many tight windows today. Yeah, and Brock didn't. We'll see. Brandon was excited because he wanted it deep. Pause. Pause. 